my channel it is your girl lovely Erica and I am here bringing you this natural and organic bee honey yes yes using one brand and it is plain Jane beauty I am loving this like I am loving this look it's simple but it's so beautiful and I cannot wait until you guys get into this now Some of you guys are probably wondering, natural and organic makeup, like, for real? How? And as you can see, it obviously works just as bomb. Like, so don't think just because it's natural and organic that you won't be able to get a look that you are looking for, like you're trying to do or fulfill. It is more than possible. And I will keep a link down there for Plain Jane Beauty. You can save 15% off by using my coupon code right down here lovely 15 so make sure you guys go check out their site they have so much other things that I didn't even get to show you in this video so be sure you check them out okay guys so we're gonna get right into this video be sure you are subscribed to my channel so you can catch up on some more vids and let's get into this beat Alrighty love, so I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys what I will be using from Plain Jane Beauty. Again, all of these will be in the description bar below. I won't be using both foundations, just one, but I wanted you to see the two foundations I do have. And now I'm going to go ahead and start off with priming. I'm going to be using the primer here. And it's kind of a lighter consistency than most primers that you're used to from regular beauty brands. Um, it comes on like a little wet and I know you can see that shine but once you rub it into the skin it does set really well um, just kind of what I'm used to so I would have to say this is a really good primer and it really kept all of my makeup in place and then I'm gonna go ahead and get started on brows now I know you guys are used to my brow routine so the only thing that's different is that I'll be using that loose powder eyeshadow powder that's brown to fill my brows from Plain Jane Beauty and um, yeah I'm so happy they put their concealers in this little pot. It is so convenient. I love it. And now I'm just going to be cleaning up my brows. And I love the way that this cleaned my brows up. And also love the way how nat loved how natural my brows looked. So I was super pleased. Super pleased. So now I'm taking that same concealer shade I cleaned my brows with and I'm going to go ahead and apply these on both of my eyelids just to make when applying my eyeshadow much more seamless. So I already went ahead and got started and did my other eye. So I'm taking that same brown eye eyeshadow shade that I used to fill my brows and I'll be putting that over my crease area and above my eye and I'm really keeping this look super simple, you guys have no idea. Then I'll be putting the green pigment that's shimmery on my lid and that really much really does it for this look. So super simple, super pretty, 
I, I love this eye look. with the concealer and I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, correct some areas that I feel like are looking a little dark just so I can bring a little bit more light into my face So now I'm going in with the foundation shade I Am Marvelous 11 and it does go on fairly light but what I realize is once it sets into my skin it makes its way and kind of formulates itself to my actual skin tone so don't be alarmed towards the end of the video of course you'll see that it blends in just fine so I really love this shade I think um, it's a really good foundation not too heavy which is also a plus if you're looking for something that's a bit on the lighter side. Then now I'm going to be going in with translucent powder just to set my face and get rid of that, you know, uh, oily look. I want to be able to have this be an all day makeup look. So I want to make sure my face is nice and matte. And then I'll be going in with the same eyeshadow I used to fill my brows to go ahead and contour and bring some warmth back into my face. Just want to look a little bit more alive, you know. Contouring is life. And then I believe next I'm going to be going in with this other pigment I have into the corner of my eye, which is super beautiful. I love how it kind of brought some life into my eye look. I, I was so in love with it. And then I'll be going in with that same eyeshadow shade for my brows in the bottom of my eyes. I'm just going to put putting on some mascara. And I'm doing this because I'm going to be prepping myself for my lashes that I'll be wearing in just a moment. And I have this eyeshadow shade that was so super cute that I thought would be a highlighter and it worked out bomb.com. As you can see, it is super cute. I love this for a highlight. So again, I'll have that information of what I use in the description bar below. So Plain Day Beauty doesn't have any lashes. So I am using the lashes. For, these lashes are from Pure Cosmetics. And I will have them down in the description box for you below. I unfortunately didn't have a plain Jane lip product, but I'm just putting on some gloss that I won't name just so I can make sure my lips aren't crusty as ever. I hope that you all enjoyed this tutorial of me using all plain Jane Beauty natural and organic makeup products. I will keep all the information for all of these products down there in the description bar below. So I have a coupon code guys so you can save some moolah when you go and shop with Plain Jane Beauty. It is lovely15 and it's right down here. So make sure you save 15% off when you go and shop with them and get some bomb products okay. So I really hope that you guys really enjoyed this tutorial. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel if you aren't subscribed and make sure you stay tuned for more videos. I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace. here and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.